okay on the day class so another example for standard atmosphere regarding the pressure altitude density altitude and temperature altitude so if the altimeter reads 10.5 kilometers so ang kukunin natin dyan is yung ambient pressure kung saan naririg niya yung 10.5 kilometers and 10.5 kilometers is pasok pa sa 0 or sea level to 11 kilometer na gradient layer so first is T is equal to T sub O plus lapse rate times the height T is equal to 288.16 Kelvin plus negative 6.5 ki um, Kelvin per kilometer times the 10.5 kilometer so T is equal to So to get the pressure at 10.5 T over P sub O is equal to T over P sub O raised to 5.26. So T is equal to P sub O times T over P sub O raised to 5.26. So P is equal to um, 101.325 Pascal times uh, 219.91 Kelvin over 288.16 Kelvin raised to 5.26 so cancel out and ambient pressure or pressure at 10.5 kilometer is 2.5 4.4451 Pascal Okay Next um, uh, Ambient density is 1.101 kilogram mass per cubic meter Find the density altitude So ang given naman is not the altitude But yung ambient density At that altitude So hinahanap natin Ano yung altitude na yun? So first you know, um, solution. So meron kang raw one point one zero one kilogram mass per cubic meter, and ang inahanap is density altitude. So para magde reverse engineering ka lang raw over raw sub o is equal to t over t sub o raised to four point twenty six. So kailangan natin hanapin ito yung t na yan so rho over rho sub o raised to 1 over 4.26 is equal to t over t sub o and then multiplying both sides no by t sub o t is equal to t sub o bracket rho over rho sub o raised to 1 over 4.26 and then T sub O, um, 288.16 Kelvin times no, the given ambient density, uh, 1.101 kilogram mass per cubic meter over 1.225 kilogram mass per cubic meter raised to uh, 1 over 4.26. So cancel out. And then the given temperature is equal to two eighty one point zero three zero six five nine five 
that is Kelvin. So, yung temperature na yan, uh, we'll use to get the density altitude. So, paano? Using the equation na to. T is equal to T sub O plus lapse rate times the height minus the height at sea level. No? Eh, this is auto automatically zero. So, T is equal to T sub O plus lapse rate times the height. So, mapapansin nyo sa ibang video is dinidiretso na. So, ayusin lang natin tong equation na to. Transpose natin to sa kabilang side. Lapse rate times the height is equal to T minus T sub O. Uh, divide both sides by lapse rate. So, H is equal to T minus T sub O over lapse rate. So, yung H na yan is the density altitude. Then, no? so kung ano yung nakuha natin na temperature. So, 281.0306. 595 store A natin and then pwede natin isulat dito yung in store A natin yung units Kelvin minus 288.16 Kelvin over the lapse rate so in terms of kilometers yung kunin natin that is negative 6.5 Kelvin per kilometer so cancel out meron kang units of kilometer so density altitude is one point zero nine six eight two one six one three kilometer. Okay. Okay. So next um ayan it's uh, same lang nung sa other video natin pero this time this is metric system. So standard altimeter reads 45 no 4500 meters and ambient temperature is 275 Kelvin. Determine the ambient pressure, ambient density, density altitude and temperature altitude. Again no pag altimeter ibig sabihin ang nire-read niya lang is based dun sa pressure na surrounded or surrounding ng isang eroplano. So, pag altimeter, ang makukuha mo lang dyan is the ambient pressure. So, ibig sabihin, yung 4, 5 meters is the pressure altitude read by the instrument. So, for the A, what is the ambient pressure? Simply T is equal to T sub O plus lapse rate times the height and then T is equal to T sub O, 288.16 Kelvin plus the lapse rate. So that is negative 6.5 Kelvin per kilometer. So dahil nakakilometer tong 6.5 natin, simply no, convert 4.5 to kilometer. That is 4.5 kilometer. So cancel it out. Temperature is... 258 no? 258.91 Kelvin So yung temperature na yan gagamitin natin to get the ambient pressure T over P sub O is equal to T over T sub O raised to 5.26 So T is equal to P sub O times T over T sub O raised to 5.26 T is equal to 101.325 Pascal. T is 258.91 Kelvin. And then, over 288.16 Kelvin. Raised to 5.26. Cancel ang Kelvin. Ambient pressure is equal to Five seven five seven seven zero four point zero three six two eight Pascal. So that is the uh, ambient pressure. So store A natin. 
So gagamitin pa natin yan no to get the density or the ambient density. So nakita uh, nakuha na natin yung pressure, kunin natin yung ambient density. Uh, simply no by using equation of state. So P is equal to rho RT. No, divide both sides by uh, RT. So rho simply equal to pressure over RT. So yung pressure dyan is yung ni store A natin. So A and then Pascal is simply Newton per meter squared. And then the gas constant is 287.08 Newton meter per kilogram mass Kelvin times the T, no temperature. Anong temperature yung gagamitin mo? Not the 258.91 Kelvin. Kasi yung temperature na yan is yan yung temperature na narid nung altimeter. So, ang pinag-uusapan natin dito is non-standard uh, atmosphere na tinatawag. So, kailangan mong gamitin is the ambient temperature no, to get the ambient density. So, that is 275 Kelvin. So, 275 Kelvin. So, in numerical, no, density, the ambient density is simply... 0.0.73092120382038 So anong units niyan? So kung no, ipapakita natin step by step. Kailangan natin pakita step by step ang dimensional analysis. So Newton meter squared, meron kang Newton meter and denominator of denominator. So kilogram mass per Kelvin and over Kelvin. No? So, Newton, cancel out. Kelvin, cancel out. Meron kang kilogram mass, meter squared times meter, and kilogram mass per cubic meter. Ang units no, ng ating uh, density per meter cube. Okay, so yan yung um, hinahanap na ambient density. Now, no store b natin yung ating ambient density store b no bakit to get the um, density altitude so density altitude uh, is rho no h sub rho h sub rho so meron kang density Reverse engineering, so we we get like this one. Rho over rho sub o is equal to T over T sub o raised to 4.26. So, kailangan nating hanapin yung read yung instrument na density altitude na narid niya dun sa temperature correspond dun sa density altitude. So, ayusin lang natin yung formula na to. We have T is equal to T sub O raised to rho uh, no, times rho <coughs> over rho sub O raised to 1 over 4.26. And then T is equal to 288.16 Kelvin times store B kilogram mass per cubic meter over 1.225 kilogram mass per cubic meter raised to 1 over 4.26. So, cancel out temperature So, ang temperature is 255 no? 255.263785 uh, Kelvin store C so, to get the H sub rho, simply T is equal to T sub O plus lapse rate times the H or the density altitude. So, rearranging the formula, rho sub um, H sub rho is equal to T minus T sub O over lapse rate. Then, H sub rho is simply store C 
Kelvin minus 288.16 Kelvin over negative 6.5 Kelvin per kilometer. So cancel out. We have units of kilometer. H sub rho is equal to Five, no, five point zero six zero nine, five six zero eight three kilometer. So that is your density altitude. So last question: temperature altitude. So ang gagamitin natin yan, the temperature altitude is the ambient temperature, which is two seventy nine Kelvin. So direct input lang, no. So sa d, t is equal to t sub o plus lapse rate times the height which is the temperature altitude uh, h sub t so h sub t is equal to t minus t sub o over lapse rate then h sub t is equal to 275 kelvin minus 288.16 kelvin over negative 6.5 kelvin per kilometer cancel out then h sub t No, 2.024 615385 kilometer 